Hey everybody, the Dutch Viking here. I'm here to talk to you today about making the cheapest, easiest, fastest flight gate for mini quad racing. It's made out of red heating tube. I picked up this three quarter inch, 20 millimeter uh, red heating tube from Lowe's. It comes in a 20 foot section for $12. That means if I cut it in half into two 10 foot sections, six bucks a tube. And that's it. All you need are these tubes. Uh, and we're going to show you how to cut the ends real quick with a handsaw and then install them in the ground. Now, no, these only work in a turf situation. These aren't great for parking garages or anything with asphalt or concrete because they won't go in the ground. You do need that base stand. But for our applications, we pretty much always fly on turf. So these work great. So I got my handsaw here. I'm going to use my Oakley's as some safety glasses. Don't need earring protection. And all we're going to do is cut about a 30 degree angle to make a spike for this to go into the turf. That's what you want right there. Do the other side. All I'm going to do is take one end and find some soft ground and jab it in. All right. Then I'm going to take the other end, bend it across, and put it into the ground. That's my gate right there. Six dollar gate. So the cool thing about these gates is because they're made out of heating pipe and that those pipe lengths come in about 20 feet lengths, you can make them as wide or as high as you want. Sometimes we like smaller ones because they're more difficult to fly through, so they're great for training. And sometimes you want larger things. The other thing is you'll notice there's no wrap on this, no flag. That's because when we're practicing, we don't want to be chewing up expensive cloth and expensive material on training. So we just use the regular tubes. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching. Follow me at the Dutch Viking on Instagram, Twitter, and on Facebook. Fly or die.